actually the bride wants to give you her token right now while I'm giving her a toast. Okay, now Master of Ceremonies, bride and groom, members of our lovely little bridal party, friends, families. I can say that I know Sally for uh, pretty much all my life. <laughs> and uh, there isn't really one word that I can use to describe her. There, is actu there are actually several words. That's uh, caring, nurturing, uh, pleasant, <laughs> very emotional. As I'm sure we all can attest to that with all the kisses and the hugs and you know the love notes that she's passing around to. So <laughs> we can say she's extremely emotional. And uh, I know that she and Jermaine, they have been together for over 10 years. And um, I know they've been through thick and thin together. They've been through a lot of challenges. And through it all, they have actually come up with a lot of love, a lot more love and compassion for one another and respect. Now, I, on a personal note, I can tell you that she has always been there for me in terms of, you know, being always concerned about my well-being, making sure I make decisions which I'm happy with, and I really do appreciate that. And I just want to take the opportunity to wish the newlyweds all the happiness, health, and prosperity that this life has to offer. And also, Sally, I'd like to wish you both. Uh, you can listen to me on this one. <laughs> Sally and Jeremy, I'd just like to wish you both uh, the joy that a uh, third member can give you yeah. when yeah. you know yeah. <laughs> joy yeah. to, that, to your family. <laughs> I wish you that joy. <laughs> now, uh, with all that said, we could just raise our glasses to uh, toast to the newest Mistress Batik. <laughs> Thank you again. Wow, we can't stop feeding each other. Yes, thank you for such a passionate and uh, heartfelt toast to the bride.